Okay. So, I'm going a little bit mad while trying to speedrun this game, so I'm just gonna show you two, diff two of the skips I didn't mention on my previous part and some uh, some other important tricks, right? First of all, when the game starts, the counter in game starts, but speedrunning time calculation is not done when you're spawned in. Uh, it is when you start pressing W, A, S, D or any input key, right? So you can just escape, go to settings and set your FPS limit to 90. Save it and back up, back up because this this helps you with almost um, like for important skips, which is a waifu skip as well. Waifu skip is much more consistent on 90, 60 and 90 FPS. And yeah, I will be showing the 90 FPS one. So let's resume the game. So the timer actually starts when you Press W here, right? So let's go to do waifu skip. Right? Uh, sorry. Um, in waifu skip, what you want to do is you come to here, right? Uh, if you are having trouble with here, just uh, like climbing on top of the bed, you can just go W and just do WS. Okay? When you're on top of this bed, what you want to do is pre uh, hold C key to go to first person. It's a little bit creepy, but yeah. So in 90 FPS, what you want to do is on your with your left left foot, okay. Uh, the right of your left foot needs to align with the pillow end of the pillow. Then you just press S and you press W, and as you can see, when you get to the sunflower, just press or tap S because you want to get to this pad and from this pad you just come to here or to the boat and yeah that's that's the waifu skip that's the advanced waifu skip so in to f like as i said when you are at the height of the sunflower almost start pressing s tapping s slow yourself down because because not because because the bed or uh, under here is actually like it preserves the momentum if you have a lot of momentum it can bounce you back so with minimum momentum hit it and jump to the boat or to the set or any of the barrels or what you can do is what I did just now like hit the side of it and grab and lose like two to three seconds and then just jump on top of it uh, with some momentum towards here and but basically right okay Okay guys, so if you don't do that waifu skip, uh, the insane waifu skip to this bed, what you can do is, if you do the other skip waifu, just the waifu bed, to that tentacle as I shown before, right? What you can do if you come to here, just before this barrel, just before this barrel, just press W, it will reach here. And if you were to jump on it, you can land on the boat. Okay. Now there's a couple of important tricks here with this boat skip. I come to here. As I said, double control, get in, look to the right. Go to here, first person, and find the line here. And I'm, I'm, I'm just luckily enough, I'm already in there. I don't know why. It sometimes happens. Okay. So as you can see, I'm lined up with. You, you want your feet to be there when you're crouched. Then go to third person, press one. You want to see the sail a little bit on top of your screen when lining up the camera as well. And the sail wood, okay, this this wood and this wood, right, needs to align with where I'm. I'm just gonna show you. Okay, yeah. In here, you can see this tree, right? This tree needs to be in the center of your screen. And this both things need to line up. This is the first one, right? This needs to cover it so that you do not see any statues between that tree. And there is like a little bit of sky, like this much. And then that uh, wooden plank, uh, wooden sail is there, okay? So. You start to align it right here. As you can see, you do not you see some, but not 
like now you do not see any right yeah this uh, this is the perfect one like as i said there is a tree okay you can see the sail a little bit on the top of the screen you see this plank lined up okay and this line this this and that plank uh, wood supports for the sail needs to be aligned when you press slow-mo and start pressing uh, space all right and then at the uh, uh, and after that position when they line up you pressing you are pressing space right your player will move to the left and when it moves to the left you see this uh, cord or like string whatever it is when this string has this, this part you just stop the slow-mo and just press space okay okay let's see yep. if I then uh, in this boat what you want to do for stowaway skip is you just crawl here look to the right and to go to the first person camera get up get to here s jump s s and jump right get your feet a little bit closer yeah that's that looks similar but yeah that might be uh, like that might do it as well so i just want to be sure that i was on 90 fps because these parts are played in 90 fps so everything from the start champagne is 90 fps so you just do the this part as i said previously most likely yeah and you start jumping space all the way to here yeah keep on pressing and when it lands and as you can see you did it um hey guys so right okay so there is a trick right um and i will i will explain the trick in a second but this is recorded after every other glitch i did uh, every other skip right so what you want to do is change your input keys so you just press windows and search for local app data under uh, the percents are there okay then press enter it will get you the app data local, right? In here, you will just find only up. Go to saved. Go to config. Go to Windows and find the. Open that up. Paste this in. This is. Uh, by the way, this trick is only in I think unrestricted. Any percent not restricted. Like. Uh, yeah, there is a different category for this but if you just want to know how they do it right so these are the game uh, inputs right like double spacebar jumps left control just what do you call it crutch and every other stuff is here and uh, this is usually empty um, so you just copy paste this from the description below Right, and this is adding uh, everything is the same except for jump action you, you you can use mouse wheel axis any of them uh, like in the mouse wheel you go up it jumps go down it jumps and in jump action it is our stance section which is crouch T and the ragdoll action which is added uh, in here uh, with E right then you just save this okay you just save it and after you save it, those, for me it's just not save. Go to properties, and this tick is you is like this for you read only. You just apply read only. That's it. After that, you can start your only up. And here is how you fucking do the trick. It is so fucking funny. Uh, sorry that I don't have all my keys on the left side, but. What you can do is this, you just jump and do ART, ART, and when you gain some speed, you just press spam ART, right? When you gain that 
boost which you will gain eventually you just spam this right like still i'm s slow mowing when you gain that boost you just stop pressing it TRT, 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 TRT. actually if you just stop now it's you have some momentum but like sometimes it can throw you so far which <laughs> did it for me on the last one like i'm currently as you can see i'm just doing art art yeah and like this still goes when you don't push slow down uh, slow more right and like every time you slow down if you just do a ERT it just pushes you up 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 uh, don't worry if you hit anything or you get stuck anywhere just jump off and do <laughs> just like here for example we are stuck here right just slow more ERT 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 and if you were yeah right like path, just wait for an opening up repeat. and do ERT 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 and <laughs> yeah as you can see we are going up all the way right we are going all the way up the main problem here is get to the unfortunately to the space uh, the ending part can be tough because don't have that much control here but like if you somehow yeah as you can see i'm controlling it a little bit better now and i'm just gonna roll and hope that it gives me a little bit more control let's see it doesn't right it okay so I was almost there. Let's do a little bit of ERT and yeah, just just roll to roll double control or double R works as well, I think. No, double T, sorry. <laughs> works as well and as you can see, we are here in 2 minutes. This is just bullshit, I know, but uh, I just wanted to show it to you guys as well after the last update he added a social elevator here which i made a short about and i will just skip this forward and i'll see you at the end guys as you can see it, it took almost four to five minutes that's 45 it's four to five right so you this elevator takes you just to here that's why i it forwarded it right nice now that that is done as well yeah let's that's the end of the video I'll just continue up from here. I don't know why I did that. I'm, I'm just gonna not. But yeah. Um, unfortunately, I haven't been able to just get this crazy dragon skip that makes it to the right. That to which you make it to right. I just cover to show you just like now. Some kind of. You just go in the middle, go towards there, Stop drifting. go Run to here, to I'm able to, tra your hopes and your as you can see, I was going to say I'm able to traverse the maze, but as you saw it, I even suck at that, so yeah, I cannot do this skip yet, I can do, I can 50% of the time just get on top of the dragon, if I do this maze correctly but I haven't been able to like properly do the skip yet so I cannot show that but 
yeah i hope that by the time the next week comes i have been training that for two weeks i will be able to do that skip and the second skip which is i'm currently unable to do is this skip which you just jump up from this trampoline and use that i could use this tree to jump all the way to this desk i think it is i, I have been able to do those uh, consistently but i am trying them every day as you can see i can get that height but never to that part never to that part i might be missing some more tricks um like yeah, there there is some tricks I might be missing. If you have any questions about the tricks uh, that I'm not showing in this video or the previous video, just let me know in the comments. Thank you for your uh, how can I say? Thanks for you just giving the support on the first video. Uh, it went better than I could ever dream of. So yeah, uh, I, I I hope to see you in couple of days uh, yeah the next video will be most likely so this video will be out on Friday I think on Saturday we have as you know the weekly recap um, for our game development and I think Monday will be how to set up the timer for speedruns and auto auto splitter for the speedruns and i think i'm hoping next friday will be the third installation of uh, the skips which uh, will include as i told the, the the new dragon skip which takes you to the final part and that trampoline jump that takes you to that takes you to the elevator almost instantly right so yeah uh, see you guys on the next video i hope you like if you enjoyed the video just like it and if you want to get the notifications just turn on the bell and subscribe see you guys